welcome to my channel, it's Perfect Cat Tarot. It's Cat. Reading cards for Aquarius right now for the week, not month, the week of March 13th through the 19th. Hope everybody is doing well. That's like not so warm here in Florida, <laughs> where you guys are located, but we're having a little bit of a cold spell. Of course, to some of you, our idea of cold is, you know, tropical. <laughs> Anyway, hope everybody's doing good. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I would love it if you do. Uh, if you want to be notified when I upload new videos, you just hit the bell there and um, you get a notification. So let's see what's going on with Aquarius, March 13th through the 19th. Two of Wands, the Empress. Okay, I'm just gonna pull them out and then I'll put it all together. Empress, star, it's your card, Aquarius. The Emperor, ooh, we got a matching set. Ooh. Nine of Cups. This is a good damn reading so far, Aquarius. <laughs> Three of Wands. You, you traveling somewhere? You traveling somewhere, Aquarius? Where you going? Away from trouble. That's where you're going. That's the Six of Swords right there. <laughs> wow, a lot of movement. Uh oh. Mm. Three of Swords. Okay. And the Queen of Pentacles. All right, let's put this bad boy together. So we got the Two of Wands. Thinking about traveling. He's got the little globe in his hand there. The world spread out in front of him. Um, could be at a crossroads trying to decide because twos in tarot always indicate two different choices. Could be deciding uh, which path you want to take, uh, which route to go. Uh, it could be travel. All right, the Empress. I feel like that's your energy right now, Aquarius. You are uh, on top of your game, doing well, uh, very abundant, uh, just really uh, in your energy and um, radiating positivity. And uh, so, what I'm looking for <laughs> abundance. The star, that's your card, that's Aquarius. Star is guaranteed good fortune, great things ahead of you. Um, just really bright things on the horizon for you. Uh, again, just coming into a time of um, fertility and not necessarily like in a pregnant kind of way, but like, you know, if you plant a seed right now, it's almost guaranteed to flourish. Um, you're on the right path to something. Like you might be trying to figure out still which direction to go, but you're like guaranteed success when you do make that decision. Okay, very bright things on the horizon for you. Very abundant right now, okay? The emperor is also here, so that is a matching set. So, um, some kind of divine partnership going on. Um, if you're in a relationship, it is fated. It is meant to happen. It is um, meant to be. Sorry, I <laughs> lost my thoughts there. Nine of Cups is wish fulfillment. Okay. So your wishes are coming true. Everything is happening for you. It's all coming into place. The Three of Wands. Again, traveling. Um, I dropped one on the floor. I gotta go. Again, traveling. Okay. So, I don't know. Maybe you're going to do something um, that re involves travel. Moving away from difficulty in hard times. So, if you have been in a period where things haven't been going well or if they've been stagnant or troublesome you're moving away from that 
and into better times. Now, I do have the Three of Swords here, which can indicate a third party situation. It can indicate uh, heartbreak. But I feel more like you're coming out of this. You're moving away from this. Um, with the, uh, the way that the cards are laid out, the succession of them, I feel like you're moving out of this. Okay, so maybe you were in a time where you were stuck and heartbroken and just like, you know, not feeling all that great. But I feel like you're coming out of that and into abundance and prosperity and great, great things coming your way. And here's the Queen of Pentacles. She's very stable and secure and um, really about her business and has it going on. And I feel like this is what you're becoming. You're manifesting this, okay? Now, I was going to say, let's pull some cards for your person, but I'm not feeling a romantic reading here. So, I, I'm not going to pull cards for somebody else, because I feel like this is, you're just coming into a time of abundance and prosperity. You're going to be very financially secure. Things are looking really great for you, Aquarius. It's just what I'm feeling. I'm not going to pull a romance angel. I, again, I don't feel like this is romantic. Um... I'm going to pull Spirit Animal Oracle card. Um, let's see what we get with these. I feel like that is more fitting for what we have going on here. I mean, kind of a short reading because I didn't pull cards for a person, a second person. But I just feel like this is very direct and to the point. It's just got good things coming your way. <laughs> Great reading. Let's get some advice for Aquarius, please. Koi fish spirit. There is always enough. Okay. So like I said, if you're coming out of a hard time, you know, don't be concerned because you're coming into prosperity. I mean, the future looks really great for you right now. Skunk spirit. Know your worth. Okay, believe in yourself. Know your worth. Okay, you're going to make great things happen here, Aquarius. I feel it. Well, that one went flying. Hawk spirit. Okay. Let spirit be your guide. Okay, so I don't know what higher power you believe in, if you do believe in one, but... Let that be your guide, okay? Because you have really fantastic things ahead of you, Aquarius. And I'm so excited for you because this is nothing but beautiful. And this is a kick-ass reading. And I wish I was Aquarius right now. <laughs> um, but that's what I have for you for this week. Um, just freaking beautiful reading. So enjoy. <laughs> All right. And... Um, let me know if this applies to you in the comments down below. Uh, you're always free, feel free to comment. Uh, like I said, if you haven't uh, subscribed to the channel yet, I would love it if you do. Join the little Scorpio Cat family. And um, that's what I got for you. See you next time.